Hi, and welcome to my very first Let's Play series in 2021. My name is Groots, and I like to play role-playing games, particularly those of Japanese origins. I decided to do this on my channel because during the pandemic, I realized that life is short and fleeting. I've wanted to start my own Let's Play channel ever since I was a kid, did not have the means to do so. This year, I plan to check that off my bucket list, in case I lose the chance to do so in the future. This is Final Fantasy VII Remake, which I consider my game of the year for 2020. I want to play through it again and take it all in and celebrate this nostalgic and remarkable game. If you would like to join me in this journey, feel free to subscribe and leave a like. With that said, let's get on with the game. Camera controls, I never use inverted, so let's go with default and normal. Okay, so this part was not in the original, but gives us a good perspective of the world. Final Fantasy VII was released in April 10, 2020 and I actually brought it, I mean bought it, in lunch day and I loved it. I really like this shot because we get to see Midgar in its totality, which is the setting of this whole game. That's actually the lyrics of One Winged Angel in the background. And I like how they depict the city here. The graphics are awesome, by the way. I think one of the biggest changes in this game compared to the original is just the amount of exposition that the game makes, both in graphics and in the characters. Um, there are new and old characters which were enriched. Okay, this is where the original starts from. I was in awe when I saw Aerith, Aerith in this game, Aerith, um, when I saw her face. Because if you're coming from the original, the graphical overhaul really puts a smile on your face. Okay, so a bit of a disclaimer, there are parts of this game where the audio would just cut off. I think it's a problem with my capture card. Hopefully, in the next episode, it doesn't come up anymore. Bruh. Kill that guy. Here it comes. Oh, 
Wow. That's so epic, dude. Okay, so this train scene is really repetitive. In Crisis Core, if you play that game, the game also starts like this. But the, the main character is Zack. Mako Reactor 1? Mako? Is it Mako or Mako? Okay, so we begin. I like that you can see the material behind his sword. Okay, nothing behind here. Basics of battle. Use square to attack. Hold square to unleash an attack capable of hitting multiple nearby enemies. You're coming with us. Nice and easy. Don't think so. Level up. So in the first game, that also happens after your first fight. You level up one level two, level seven I believe. There should be a. There's no potion here. <laughs> That's actually a tradition of the Final Fantasy series. Hands where I can see him. Have fun. I will. The ATB gauge. The ATB gauge. Fills as time passes, and by attacking with square, once the bar is full, your character can perform special actions. Okay. Freeze! So. Move and we shoot! Go ahead. Okay. Expanding ATB gauge. Alright. Enough of this. That sucks. <laughs> it's too far away. Um, options to open the main menu. Okay. Okay. Um, from the main menu, you can view your inventory gameplay. Let's so even load your game. So as you can see, Cloud is level 7 right now. In FF8, Squall starts at level 7. And after the first battle, he becomes level 8. Perhaps signifying the numbered entry in the game. Where are they hiding? Yeah, what he said! Or want to guard? Okay. You're coming with us. Can't get surrounded. Try harder. Try this. <laughs> Nothing to it. Okay, so I have a pretty good idea of this game. But let's see if I don't mess up. Okay, this is a tutorial for the chest.
Grenades? Haven't used those in my previous playthroughs. Okay, Shinra boxes, which we should break. Hiya! So what's Soul Boy's deal? Is he one of us now? He's got balls, this, uh, uh, what was his name again? Cloud. Cloud Strife. Right. And he isn't a soldier anymore. Still. He's a professional, the rest of us. I'm glad to have him. <laughs> this is a one-time gig. When it's done, we're done. Uh, <laughs> Talk about sassy. I like how the idle banter continues, even as the scene plays. Nobody do something this crazy just for money. They may not think you're a true believer, but you know what I think. Not interested. What? Uh, <laughs> what a noob. Which? Uh, You better be worth the money, Merc. Every last gill. The shot, though. <clears throat> okay, let's go. R3 to lock on the target. Go okay. boy! That's your first. Okay, here we get to see the stagger mechanic, which is something they borrowed from Final Fantasy Thirteen. Um, I like this system. It's really satisfying. Yeah. The goal of the game is Looks like to you're next. fill up that stack of meat and then unleash all your damages once the enemy gets that. Way. Let's go. I forgot how to do the shortcuts. Um, L1 plus rank or. Okay, forgive me. I'm still getting used to the controls. Let me out. I think there's a chest. Oh, just boxes. This way. Faster, dude. I want to go in. Not so fast. <laughs> We've got company. Try to keep up. really does increase the stagger meter a lot. I think I'll probably use that more often in this play too. Is my HP okay? Yeah, still okay. Nothing? Come on. 
No chest, no chest. Okay, we can't go there. Okay, so down. the soldiers are just pushovers. They usually die even before you stagger them. This is a potion. How do we use? Okay, here we go. Yay! Alright, so I think this is the part where we enter the actor itself. Okay, Midgar has 8 sectors and each sector has a reactor. Um, this is for sector 1. Okay, Soldiers in the may interior. attack on command, but I hear they make good gogs too. Bet you've seen a few reactors. So how do we get to the bridge above Mako storage? <sighs> Ain't holding out on me, are you? Stamp scared to bite the hand that fed him? Or is he a loyal little doggy? Have it your way, Mutt. We can do this with you, or we can do this with you. Different reactor, different layout. Depends when it was built. Never seen one like this, but I'll manage. Don't you worry. Fix the door open soon. In three, two... Damn, I'm good. Who's there? Door! Oh, wait! It's over! That my line. Okay, so Cloud's unique ability is Punisher Mode. Um, I didn't use this much in my last playthrough, but... Apparently, the counters are what's useful. So let's try that out. He's alone. Okay. We can take him. Make it rain. <sighs> let's get this over. No holding back. I see you. Okay, <laughs> that was bad. <laughs> he always knows just what to say. Cut it out. Well, what are you waiting for? It's a good thing I know someone who can get us the passcode. <sighs> Pity no one else at command will talk to us, but what can you do? <sighs> then we're good. Okay, we good. Careful in there. Jesse smiles, okay? And up like these boxes. Hear that? Where are you? What are you waiting for? She's mine. Looks like the elevator's on another floor. Mind pushing that button? Security is only going to get tighter, so be ready. We can't afford any more mistakes. <laughs> so, you know Tifa, right? It's not really my business, but are you guys close? More than close.
Tifa and I. Sewer rats appear to call themselves Avalanche, sir. We are currently investigating whether they belong to the same group that made the attempt on your life. Rest assured, our inquiries will not take much longer. <laughs> this pump's sole purpose is to drain the planet dry. While you sleep, while you eat, while you sit, it's here sucking up Marco. It doesn't rest, and it doesn't care! You do realize what Marco is, don't you? Marco uh. is the lifeblood of our world. The planet bleeds green like you and me bleed red. The hell you think's gonna happen when it's all gone, huh? Answer me! You gonna stand there and pretend you can't hear the planet crying out in pain? I know you can! You really hear that? Did I do? Get help. <laughs> Say that again. I'd worry less about the planet and more about the next five seconds. Save the screaming for later. It actually has a good point though. Our lives are on the line now. You listening, Merc? One false move. And that happens. Well, so much for having Cloud do all the fighting. There are some places a sword just can't reach. <laughs> just bear with him for me, would you? <laughs> yeah. Should have asked for more money. What a weirdo. <laughs> yeah, new party member. Okay. Gonna throw your sword at him? Let the man with the gun go to work. These tin cans ain't got nothing to eat. Now for the real. So, my turn. Okay, Barrett specializes in long range. Oh. I mostly use him as a healer. Um, just because I can maintain distance. And at the same time, heal. So nostalgic. Look what we have here. The laser security system. Great. Those things will hurt more than your pride if you're careless. They'll cut you down to size and then some. But I'm guessing you kind of think before. Yeah. Figure out the timing of lasers. Then make move when they cycle off. Exactly. I'll go first. Nothing like a little danger to get the blood pumping. Hey! Just keep those baby blues of yours on me. Oh, Jesse is so thirsty. Keep dashing. Okay. Oh. 
<laughs> okay, I think this is the more complicated. Exactly, Jesse. They don't call exactly. those sweepers for nothing. They can wipe out a whole squad in seconds. Not wipe the floor with them first. Ha! Ah, we can take this hunk of junk! That hunk of junk is a heavy weapon platform. If we rush in, we die. Is that right? We need to hit it with magic. That should give us an open. Hit it with magic. Keep it together. Yeah, I'll do it. What? Let's put it down. Give it all you got. Now's our test. Go. Don't need to tell me twice. I'm going to enjoy this. Finish it. Ah, uh, I meant to use the focus chart. So I'm getting a good bit rusty at this game. The stagger system was actually from Final Fantasy 13, which is not a good entry in the franchise. But for me, it had a really good battle system. That's our target, the reactor core. Gotta set the bomb at the bottom. Do that for the laughs. Did you call me? Oh, you're choosing me over the reactor? That's sweet, but I'll wait my turn. Go blow her mind. Okay, so our next task is to set the bomb. This will be quick. Okay. Oh, we're done here. 
So sometimes Barrett sings TV through fanfare. So far, yes, it done it. So. Let's hope he does it later. Okay. What? Not the boss already? Let's do this. Let's do this. Little stamp really can bite the hand that feeds. Hmm. Go on, do the honors. Prove to me you're the Mantifa says you are. That you're one of us. Never said I was. I'm just here for the paycheck. Then do the damn job! Fine. What about the timer? Your call, Merc. Pretty cocky, ain't you? I am. <gasps> you double crossing! Heads up! What in the hell? It is the first boss battle, so I hope I remember. Armor plated, but the internals can be overloaded. Uh, how do you dodge again? Nope. How do you dodge? Don't overdo it. You've got it over. Hell yeah! You see the challenge I did? Keep it up. Try this. It's on you. the only downside to the boss battles because uh, usually you get interrupted with cutscenes when you reach a certain point so when you're unloading everything you can get interrupted and everything you did would be a waste oh okay that's a dodge Hell no! This thing is tough! It wouldn't be much of a weapon if it went down easy. Don't compliment the giant scorpion! There! Attack it from the rear! I sold you, boy! Show me what you got! If we don't change it up soon, this thing's gonna kill us both! Less talking, more shooting! How about let this from you? I got this. Oh. 
You don't want to be hit by that laser. Huh? So, what do we do? Don't get hit. Take cover behind that debris. So you have to time your limit because um, parts of the fight are scripted. Showed you how it's done. Come on, 
We've got to move. Okay. You me, Jesse. Come this way. This route should lead us straight to Barrett. Probably. I think I see an exit. Come on. There's a chest. The soundtrack of the game is phenomenal, in my opinion. Especially for new fans who's listening to it for the first time. Another one of the game's negatives is the camera. Just look at how it malfunctions here. Oh. 
even though sorry. So that's how you beat the shock trooper. I actually didn't know that that's how you beat it. You keep forgetting that guarding is a thing in this game. Yes, he's yes. so thirsty.
Looks like we made it. And with nothing but a few scratches to show. <laughs> Think you might have overdone it? I followed the instructions to the letter. Well, let's hope the city's still in one piece. But the planet's what matters, right? <laughs> I mean, this must have helped some. After all that, it had better have. Anyway, let's get going. We in Sector 8? That'd be just down there. All right then, lead the way. You got it. Huh. Okay, so I think I'm gonna stop it there. Thank you so much for watching. And um, there are some sound issues in this first part, but hopefully I remedy that in the next part. So subscribe if you want to see the next episode first, and leave a like if you like my video. Peace out.